What is going on, everybody? Stephen Freshy on the scene here with the Clock Tower Heroes. I haven't played this deck yet. Like, I just built the deck um, before maintenance hit last night. Um, but I only owned one Anki. Here's how I have it. I used my dream ticket to get a second because I ran into a couple people on the ladder only playing two Anki. And the reason why I haven't played the deck yet is because I only had one Anki, but I saw a couple of lists playing playing two, so I was like, you know what? I'll use my dream ticket on an Anki. I got a glossy Anki, so let's try the deck. But yeah, I'm playing 30 because, you know, go big or go home. Nah, no, just kidding. But yeah, um, yeah, Clock, Clock of Destiny. If you guys don't know what the skill does, let's read it. <clears throat> Each of the following effects can be used once per duel. Send one level four or lower Destiny Hero Monster in your hand to the graveyard then add one clock tower prison from your deck to your hand select one clock tower prison in your field zone and place three clock counters on it then you could add one mystical space typhoon to your hand from your deck return the clock tower prison to your deck at the end of your next turn the skill can only be used if you begin the duel with a deck that contains eight or more destiny hero monsters and no monsters other than destiny hero or elemental hero monsters extra deck is not included so we can play whatever we want in the extra deck, but as long as our main deck is Destiny Hero and Elemental Hero Monsters, which we have um, our three Elemental Hero and the rest Destiny Heroes. And um, we're playing three Mass Chains. Since I only have two Anki, but I still think three Mass Chains will come up because we, we can go into um, Blast with Stratos and um, Mass Chains. Playing two Chalice, two Tretch because it's the best card in the game. And uh, Chalice, we can kind of cheese wins with a 32 direct attack Anki. Because what you do is, um, since you can't redeclare your attack in the damage step, um, you Chalice Anki in the damage step when he attacks directly. And then his attack goes to 3200, so his effect is negated to deal half the battle damage. So instead of just attacking directly for 1400, you Chalice and it goes up to 3200. And since it can't redeclare its attack, it's 3200 direct attack. And then we're playing Lightning Vortex just because we're going to be getting a lot of card advantage off drawing. And sometimes we want to we wanna reduce our hand to draw, um, to use Celestial's effect to draw. So yeah, I haven't played this deck yet, you guys. So this will be a first. So let's see how we do, man. Also, if you haven't already, smash the like button. Subscribe if you're new. And turn up notification bells so you don't miss out on my videos. But yeah, let's get into this, man. Uh, also, I don't have Destiny Draw, the card from Aster because I haven't leveled up Aster to 40. Um, but if I did, I'd probably take out, um, I don't know, like a Lightning Vortex for it, maybe. But yeah, let's give it a try. Also, let me put this deck list up here. All right, there's the deck list. All right, we're going second against probably Photons. Okay. So we got a pretty good hand. We got an MST. We got a Book of Moon, which we could flip down his galaxy eyes. So that way it'll turn his um quick play spells off. So this is winnable. And we can stall with Clock Tower too, which is pretty good. And we get a free MST, which is really good. So he's going to search his Photon Stream. Going to go into his Galaxion. Then probably special summon a Galaxy Eyes from the deck. The typical photon play. All right, my turn. Oh, 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 let's do it. We'll get rid of the chalice. 
Oh, I feel bad for this guy, man. <laughs> We're playing three Vortex. <laughs> All right, let's activate the skill. Send one, yes. <laughs> Vortex OP. Oh, man. Oh, man, this skill is degenerate. <laughs> Write down in the comments below whether you think this skill needs a nerf or not. <laughs> oh, man. Uh-oh. I'm rich! Look at that. Look at all those gems. Nice. <laughs> Take those gems and get my third Anki, maybe. By the way, if you guys are wondering, I got King of Games um, this season with DDDs. If you guys want to watch that climb, you can um, follow my Twitch channel and check out my one of my recent streams. We got King of Games with um, DDDs. Alright, Melodious now. This could be kind of weird. I guess Bloom Diva, we, we have Chalice in the deck. Um, another thing we could do is... Malevolent Sin for game if, it, if the opportunity is there. Um, also, we could book a moon stretch, but that's kind of tough to pull off. But we could see, we'll see what, what we'll see what happens. We could also kind of stall on Decider. Yeah, let's just activate the skill. Um, yeah, we'll send Drill Dark. I kind of want to stall on Decider for now. And we'll see if he has MST. Okay, so he has the Cyclone. Okay, that's fine. We'll just summon the Decider. Yes, I will activate the effect because I want my Drill Dark back. And we'll set the mass change, set the tretch, set the book of moon, pass, for now. Give me that drill dark back. Doesn't have anything to add back with Chopina, so we can, we can hold off on the tretch. He can't attack me either. So we're just gonna wait. That's a top deck. Alright, just pass. Don't want to play into his stretch. So this, actually, Dreadmaster can be Tribute Summon, right? Discard a special and destroy all, then you can... Yeah, I guess it can. All right, we're just going to stretch here. Okay. Vortex. Now he probably has a he probably has a um he probably has a necrofusion set. So let's just set this as a bluff and we'll swing. Well, that goes through. Now, do we want to go for lethal? Yeah, I guess we'll force the back row. Yeah, yeah, we'll force the back row. Lethal direct attack. If he has Necrofusion, we just direct attack. Yeah, we got him. GG. I'm pretty sure he had a treacherous face down. We 
we, we played around that treacherous perfectly. Let's see. Let's see if he plays treacherous. Which 99% of Melodious players play two of them. Because they can just banish the other one with Schuberta. And, and uh, resolve two treacherous in one game. Yep. GG, buddy. Uh-oh, is this the mirror match? Well, I think whoever goes first in the mirror match has the advantage, because you could search MST and get rid of their clock tower. So we open clock tower. So I guess we don't have to use the skill to search it, but we can at least search for a, um, a cosmic cyclone. Or, I mean, not a cosmic cycle on a mystical space typhoon. So, yeah. Activate skill. Oh, we don't have to send one. Okay. So, yeah, we don't have to send one from the hand. So, we just add an MST for free, I guess. Set the vortex as a bluff. Set this. Do we want to summon this? I mean... It wouldn't be a bad idea to get the cards to the graveyard, but we want to keep one in hand. Um... Yeah, let's just set this. Pass. See what happens. Okay, now we can't get OTK this turn if this stays on the field. Oh, Dark... Dark Lords, wow. With Aster, interesting. Well, we do have Vortex. We can force him to, um... Kind of force him to... Use a Tez in hand, maybe. We'll see what happens. I'd like to draw into a Celestial so we can get future draws. Contact. Okay. 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 Let's vortex. Oh, it went through. So now we just. Now we just pop this and win, right? This deck is broken! Double lethal. This deck is busted, guys. Holy crap. <laughs> Alright, we'll do one more game. I appreciate y'all for watching, though. Yeah, this deck, this deck is busted, man. Holy crap. <laughs> Alright, versus Mako Tsunami. Mythic Depths. Ooh, that's a hand. 
Gotta love Mako's theme, though. Alright, Lantern Shark. Can't use Lantern Shark's effect. What's he going to? Abyss Dweller? Okay, at least we don't have to worry about him popping my cards. With, um, what's his face? Marks, er, Heavy Infantry. Book of Moon. Let's go ahead and activate. Send this. Activate. Activate the skill. Yes. Yes. Okay, we're just gonna save the MST and we're just for now we're just gonna go Stratos for Stratos. Stratos for Stratos. <clears throat> okay, we're going to set the MST, set the mass change. Set the Book of Moon. Pass. Yugi Shita, fight on! Okay, let's mass change here. For the blast. Activate. Reduce in half. If he chains Fiendish Chain, we could chain our effect to bounce Fiendish Chain. Okay, he didn't do it. Activate the blast. Return. And we can save our MST here <clears throat> for the clock tower. Oh, my God, this deck is busted. Bouncy, 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 bouncy. Bouncy, bouncy, complete control. CC, complete control. Summon the Stratos. Pop the back row. Complete control. Get that out of here. That's fine. Two thousand defense. What? Your opponent cannot target face up water monsters for attack except this one. All water monsters you control gain three hundred. Okay, so we have to attack this. I want to save. I'm not going to set the Tretch because... Well, I could book a moon now and set the Tretch. Yeah, we're going to book a moon now and set the Tretch. That way we could use Chalice when he uses Dweller. Th this way, if we save Chalice for Dweller, we can MST pop this. So yeah, let's flip this. Let's set the Tretch. And let's swing over the Dweller first. 
해쳐버려 몬스터를 공격하겠어 누구 마음대로 몬스터 효과 발동 Chalice. 해서 협동 마법 발동. 오케이, okay, get rid of that. Attack into that. Boom. Activate the MST. Pop. And GG. I'm not sure if it was lethal because we only had one... We only had one um, Destiny hero in the grave. So we'd be able to get... Um, 3200 damage but we have treach set if he tries to do anything on the on the follow-up so yeah but yeah guys i enjoyed playing this deck man um i'm definitely gonna play a lot more of this deck uh on stream so if you guys don't want to miss out on that make sure you follow me on twitch also if you want to watch the ddd climb that i did earlier in this season you can check that out i'll leave a link to my twitch channel in the description of this video also if you haven't already smash the like subscribe for more content I'm Stephen Freshy, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.